need is me and I do just what I like If I want it, I can get it and I put that on ice Why she acting different, try to throw it to the side She used to be so funny, now she What's up, y'all? I'm back again with another video And, um, I did something completely, uh, ludicrous and not financially responsible I spent $180 on some $80 Crocs So, yeah don't judge me, but I had to do what I had to do. And I'm be honest with y'all, I do not regret it. Not one bit, okay? Because these are the most comfortable Crocs that I ever put my feet in. Told y'all I had a Croc video for you guys. Of course, I interjected some other stuff in there in between. Um, if you watch my last video, you'll know why. I was in a car accident. And yeah, that's my life. So, um, the I'm, I'm, I keep forgetting forgetting how to pronounce the name but it's the Salehi Benberry Crocs Polex Clog um in the color urchin so the hypebeast Crocs of course I spent an extra hundred dollars on them because that's the only way I was gonna get my hands on some and like I said I'm not mad about it I'm not mad about it all so it came in the, the box of StockX sent it in here's the StockX, StockX verification receipt and here is the box that the shoes came in um so a little something about these just for sizing purposes so you guys know because i was so scared to order these off stock x because i was like if they don't fit i'm not gonna be able to return them y'all one of my plants is wilting terribly bad lord jesus sorry i got distracted anyway I wasn't going to be able to return them because it's StockX. And I mean, I might have been able to get away with returning like this one item. But I didn't really want to go through all, all of that because I really wanted the shoes. Um, okay, so like I was saying, the sizing. I had to get a size 5, which is a women's 7. I am a women's 8 or even a 7.5, depending on the shoe. Um, but I basically had to size down a size and a half. So I would have been like a six and a half, I want to say, in men's shoes for these because I think the six and a half is an eight and a six is a seven and a half, if I'm correct. My bad. So I had to go down to a size five because the shoes are cut big. And that's the recommendation that I was seeing all across YouTube. Um, even I think he recommended that you size down a size and a half. At least if you're a woman, I don't know about men's shoes, but I also know men have wider feet. So I really don't know about men's, but I know that I am a seven and a half slash eight in women's and I had to size down to a five in men's, which is a seven in women's. Okay, y'all? I hope that makes sense. I hope I was clear because sometimes I stumble all over my words and I mess everything up. But here we go. Again, um, you can see the sizing and everything. And it's in the color urchin, which is like the silvery looking type color. Um, well, this says mauve mist. But. This says urchin. Is urchin the name of the crock itself? sue me that's embarrassing anyway um this color says mauve mist on the box it says it on the receipt but then it also says urchin so salehi burn is that his name y'all like oh my god am i an idiot anyway like i said that's embarrassing uh, <laughs> lord jesus so here we go i'd be learning just as much as y'all be learning okay when i make these videos i swear but here it is it came wrapped pretty pretty you know decent it's a crock i really wasn't expecting much um and here's the shoe here it is here it is i'm trying to look at what it says on here for color wise but it doesn't say anything um yeah it doesn't say anything at all so here's the shoe we have the StockX um verification tag in this lighting like from where i'm looking at it not seeing it in the camera it definitely looked kind of pink i'm not gonna hold y'all so the mauve mist color makes sense but i'm just giving you guys the whole workaround and i will try them on just so you guys can see an idea of how they look i put them on already most comfortable shoe most comfortable croc i've ever put on my feet and that's why i said it's totally worth the extra money um, of course, 
most people aren't gonna spend an extra hundred dollars on a pair of shoes that literally are only worth 80 bucks um but i'm crazy so yeah i'm gonna show you all the bottoms of the shoes and i'm actually gonna go pull up that freaking um stock x thing to see the color because i swear urchin was one of the colors so i'm kind of confused about that um but yeah there you go i'm gonna try them on and i will be our b okay so here's the top view and i will give you a side view just because these are a little different than your typical croc um i don't see me wearing these with you know not i'm not in sport mode should i say ignore my dusty pants but yeah Here's the top view. I mean, they kind of remind me of foam runners, and I do plan on getting me a pair of those, so I'll have a video for that too eventually. But yeah, let me give you guys the side view. They're super comfortable, y'all. More comfortable than any regular pair of Crocs. So here's the side view. Let me know what you think, because they're kind of an ugly shoe, but I think they're different, and I think that's why I wanted them so bad. <laughs> comfortable just comfortable like literally comfortable nothing more nothing less and again these are size five and originally i'm about a seven and a half or an eight in women's so yeah that's that yeah like look it says salehi bimberry and then it has the color so somebody tell me what these are what the heck because this is supposed to be I'm like, bro, I'm losing my mind. <laughs> Literally losing my mind. So the box says mauve mist. I'm going to take it for being mauve mist, but I don't know why it says urchin. And urchin is the color. It is. I'm not tripping. Maybe it's all the same. I don't know. Like I said, I'm learning while I make this video just as much as you guys are learning watching it. So if you have anything or any advice or any... um comments in regard to that color situation just comment down below because now i'm kind of confused um and yeah anyway thank you guys for watching my video um i hope you enjoyed it even though there's some minor confusion um just so you guys can at least get the fit i mean the color and name you're gonna see the picture and the thing so i'm not so much worried about the color name being correct but um just let me know what you guys think of the shoe. Let me know if you would spend the extra $100 um, if you're crazy like I am. And yeah, that's it. I will see y'all next time. Peace out. Sorry for this mess of a video. Peace out. <laughs>